We are in 2018 and that means going back to school looks a little different. There are way fancier, way techier things to pack in your school backpack. Or, let's be honest, in your work backpack, your purse, or your briefcase, because even if you're not going to school, you deserve nice things, especially now that you're an adult and you can treat yourself, right? Absolutely. So we have Drew, Emergent Tech Editor at Digital Trends, who has brought us some back to school or work tech. We could use these for both, Really, right? they would work for both. Exactly, I, I like to pretend I'm going back to school. So where do we start, these headphones or? Let's, let's start over here with the sure. notebook. It doesn't look super techy from the outside, but it totally is. This is one of I my like favorite. I like that it doesn't look techy though, because right? then if you're carrying it around, it's like, oh, she just has a notebook. It's not anything expensive but it does have two really cool tricks up its sleeve so the first one is that it makes it really really easy to digitize your notes so if you flip it open it's got all my notes in it i actually <laughs> use this thing um, what kind of secrets can we learn it's got all here? these little symbols on it right in this qr code so using an app oh. that's paired with it you just flash it over it and it will you can mark one of these little symbols and it will pair that and send it to whatever app you choose. So it'll send it automatically to Dropbox or Google Drive mm -hmm. or Slack or really any app that you use. Oh. So it makes it really, really quick and easy to save these things in the cloud. Now that's just the first cool trick. The second one is that it's also infinitely reusable. What? As long as you use these special pens. This is a Pilot Friction pen and it uses a special kind of ink that is, I mean, it will turn invisible if you get it to a certain temperature. This is like when you would use those invisible ink pens when I was in school. Exactly. Like, Look, I wrote secret messages. So the idea is once you've filled this thing up completely, you can just pop it in the microwave for a minute. It will make all of the ink disappear and you can reuse it again. So you get to play with things in the microwave too. It makes them so exciting. And they won't catch on fire. Exactly. Key point. Wow. Okay. That's awesome. I'm totally in. Right. <laughs> all right. Next up, we have the Sony WH-1000X Mark III. Long, ridiculous name, but all you really need to know is this is the third generation of Sony's wireless noise canceling headphones. These are brand new. We just tested them out at Digital Trends and they are a front runner for like our favorite all around headphones wow. ever. Uh, what makes them good like for students? Oh, ears. absolutely. Okay. So what makes these really good I for- I can still kind of hear you, I but I'll probably start you. yelling. Hello, <laughs> what, what are we doing? <laughs> they're not even turned on. They're, yeah, they're still, <laughs> they sound great. <laughs> you sound great. <laughs> But no, what makes these things really cool is their noise canceling technology. All right, and that's what's gonna make them really useful for students when you need to drown out everybody in the dorms or your open office that for some reason everybody has now. Mm -hmm. um, this, these things come with a bunch of different kinds of noise canceling. They can like selectively filter out automotive noises. So like if you're in a cafe next to a street, it can filter out the sounds of cars. Or you can tune it to like the cafeteria setting, which would tune out voices as opposed to traffic. So really whatever setting you're in, this is going to be able to just completely isolate that noise and make it so you can concentrate. We have a very noisy newsroom and I have a tendency as you probably guessed, to, to talk to my coworkers and they talk to me back. So I feel like this would help me get a lot of work done, get editing done. It would be great. I'm in the same boat. Yes, <laughs> perfect. Okay, last but not least. All right, this is the Surface Go. So Ooh. super tiny little thing, looks kind of like an iPad. Let me mm -hmm. open it up here. But dis don't let the, uh, the small size fool you. Despite the fact this is, looks like a tablet, it's actually a full-fledged laptop. Oh. And, but it does function like a laptop or a, and, yeah, We're the a tablet as well. Wow. Um, so yeah, you size. get the portability, but you can also run full-size programs. It has a little kickstand on uh -huh, the back so you uh -huh. can use it. It's, it's really just great for anything and it's so easy to stick in the backpack. That's so cool. Well, people want to read out, because you guys have all kinds of lists of cool back to school, back to work tech, where do they go? Uh, digitaltrends.com. We have reviews of all of these things and just all of the latest news on all this kind of weird techie gear. Perfect. Thank you so much. Yeah, thanks for having me.